Okay, let's give you guys some more practice. So here, integrate this. I'm not going to tell you if you should use substitution or if you should use integration by parts. All I'm saying is that integrate this. So press pause and have a go. Okay, so to integrate this, um, visualize visualize this thing here as uh, as one block multiplying with another block. So uh, so if you get this times this, this times this, it will be the exact same thing. So visualize as one block multiplying with another block, and now um, now visualize this block here as as this. So it's to the power of minus three, and then note from here notice that um, uh, that this here is the exact derivative of the bubble itself. Okay, so 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 when you get to this stage here, when you get to this stage here, notice that uh, that this thing here is 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 the exact derivative of the bubble itself. So what that means is, if you um, so so when you try and integrate this, you are really looking for something in such a way that when you differentiate it, it will give you this whole thing here. Well, because that because this is the exact derivative of this, you should make um, you should make this to be your initial guess. Make this to be your initial guess, and then when you differentiate now, if if you were to differentiate this, it will give you this. Differentiate this, it will give you this. This goes down here, so it will be negative 2, um, uh, and then the bubble stays intact. So the bubble here stays intact, and then this thing here gets minus by 1, and then you've got to time to the derivative of the bubble itself, which will be 1 over x, which will be 1 over x. So, so if you make this to be your initial guess, if you differentiate it, it will give you, it will give you this whole thing here. So, uh, so if you, you know, notice that this is ex is exactly the same as this. This here is exactly the same as this. So all you need to do is negate this negative two. So looking back at your initial initial um, uh, initial guess, you should make the adjustment of of uh, negative a half. Now, if you if you were to differentiate this, it would then give you it would then give you this whole thing here. Without the negative two, so so when you integrate this, it would be this. So overall, overall the answer would be this. Overall the answer would be uh, negative a half, and then uh, and then bracket natural log of x uh, to the power of minus two plus c. Okay. So uh, so overall the your answer would be this. Okay.